Did you know that there is a Finnish snow god in America? Well, kinda. Let's take a look at Heike Lunta, who brings massive snowfalls to that one state I still think we should sell to Canada. Considerably younger than most of the Finnish pantheon, Heike Lunta was conceived in 1970 by David Ryuta of the Michigan WMPL radio station. The story goes that the Range Snowmobile Club of Atlantic Mine was planning a snowmobile race, which was shaping up to be more of a mobile race as there was a considerable lack of snow that year. And so Ryuta, presumably influenced by the designer drugs of the day, decided that he was going to invent a brand new Finnish god who supposedly has dominion over the snow. Ryuta even invented a brand new ritual called the Heike Lunta Snow Dance Song. No points for figuring out what it's supposed to do. And so the people of Tapiola, Michigan were terrorized by Finnish propaganda of some pagan deity who followed the whole seven Finns who immigrated to the United States and now dances naked in the woods in hopes of blowing his massive load of white stuff all over Michigan. I mean snow, you degenerate Apparently, this somehow worked, and the piles of snow grew too high. And despite the competition being a race between vehicles specifically designed to traverse the snow, it had to be cancelled because of... the snow. As a result of causing a revised ice age in Michigan, Ryuta had to come up with a counterspell. He went on to compose the imaginatively named song, Heike Lunta Go Away which, just like the aforementioned snow dance song, you can listen to here on YouTube. Apparently it worked, since nobody has put Detroit out of its misery yet. The legend goes on, and according to the infallible wellspring of knowledge that is Wikipedia, the songs are still sung by the American Finnish population today. To any Finnish speakers, which is presumably most of you watching this, the name Heike Lunta may sound a bit odd. Lunta is the partitive case of Lumi, meaning snow. Names, however, never appear in the partitive case in Finnish, and a more sensible name would be Heike Lumi, or maybe Heike Twisku, or Heike Piri, or Heike Loskapaska. And now we have reached the part of the script where Auntie has asked me to recite his standard formalities without being transformative. <coughs> this video was suggested by Digital Lurk. Many thanks, and was based on an article by Jim Gerti of Finlandia University. If you'd like to support the making of these videos, you can either grab a shirt or donate as little as one euro per month on Patreon. Links to both are in the description. Although I'm sure you're smart enough for me to not have to point that out. Based on that horrible Finnish accent, you all can probably tell that I'm not auntie. However, I am a fellow mythology creator by the name of Messiahs in Mythology. You can find my channel linked in the description down below. But you're smart enough for me to not have to point that out. Feel free to share any thoughts or prayers this video might have brought to your mind. And until next time, ladies and gentlemen of the internet, I hope you all have a God's blessed day. This is the first issue of my comic called Trolled, which is full of trolls and uh, other other stuff from Finnish mythology. Now, if you'd like to go and check it out, it's out and up for grabs. <laughs>